Staff under U.S. Senator Al Franken continued meeting with regions across the state and their ongoing rural education tour. These meetings with educators are to better understand the challenges rural communities face that their counterparts in urban communities may not. May not. A meeting was held in Staples today and our Chelsea Brown was on hand. Meeting with rural educators across the state has put into perspective challenges rural communities face among ensuring students access to high quality education. These are the folks who are, you know, the boots on the ground or are dealing with these challenges every day. And who better to hear from uh, as Senator Franken tries to work to, to make improvements. One reoccurring issue schools face in the area seem to be the lack of teacher applications. And you know, it used to be just that, uh, you know, you might have science Science teachers are really hard to find, math teachers, special education teachers, but now really it's across the board. We've, we've seen this coming for 10 years and the frustration with the legislature not willing to understand that it's school districts who are held accountable to teacher performance not our legislators. Another challenge was the lack of resources among mental health in schools, which has grown in recent years. Part of Senator Al Franken's Every Student Succeeds Act, the education reform plans to partner with community-based organizations to expand access to mental health services for students. One, you know, superintendent shared an example of a student having to drive 75 miles each way to get mental health services. And we've got to do more in that space to, to make it easier for kids to access mental health. That's where we've seen the biggest increase. And yes, they are uh, different to deal with than older children, but our very young children, when they come into the system, don't have those coping skills. And that's where we really, really struggle. Part of the discussion involves success stories in schools, such as innovative funding for technology. And this group of rural education leaders appreciate Senator Franken's staff listening to their firsthand experiences. I mean, if you take a look at the list of concerns that he has been dealing with and working for our schools, are the issues that we have. I think they, they just needed to hear from, you know, folks um, who are you know sort of out in the trenches uh, running school districts and and see that you know we're here we're working together we're trying to do the best we can for our students and that their concerns are being heard at the state and national levels in Staples Chelsea Brown Lakeland News Senator Franken's staff has already met with area educators in Rochester Wilmar and Worthington the tour will continue in April in other regions of the state including Mountain Iron and Fergus Falls if you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.